Hellebore. That is correct. R R Y Glen Gary. That is correct. That is correct. That is correct. Well, of course we love the words, but there are plenty of other things to love about Bee Week. Number one, the beekeeper. First thing our spellers get when they arrive, the beekeeper, a handy autograph book that kids pass around to collect signatures from all their new friends. It's a great icebreaker and a lasting memento. Number two, the Memorial Day picnic. Before the competition begins, we enjoy food, games, and fun. This year, we're heading to the beautiful U.S. National Arboretum for a picnic, scavenger hunt, and tours through the Living Museum of Nature right in downtown D.C. Number three, it's the Friday night dance party! That's right, after the competition ends and the pressure is off, we dance the night away. And a fun photo booth captures all the craziness. Yep, it's awesome. Speaking of awesome, number four, Dr. Bailey. Spellers love to get his autograph during the week, and you might even spot him on the dance floor Friday night. The official pronouncer is everyone's favorite. He won in 1980, and he's become the face and certainly the voice of the Scripps National Spelling Bee. And number five, friendships. The kids say it best. How's the barbecue this year? I really like making some new friends and meeting some old friends too. My favorite part of Bee Week is meeting all the new people and getting to connect with people that I usually wouldn't get to meet in other circumstances. Life changing because it is like a new thing to be at. Like you're meeting new friends from across the country. It's probably not going to be another thing like this. I get to be part of this world that most people will only ever see on television and never in real life. It was awesome. Whoa! It was like walking into Hogwarts or something. You're like, I've read about this. Or <laughs> <laughs> like, is this just a dream? Is this is this is this reality or is it a dream? Fantabulous. 